Hello everyone, it's a delight to be with you from Stadium Australia here in Sydney. I'm Derek Ray and my commentary partner as always is Stuart Robson. And it's match day one in the group stage for these two nations here at the 2023 Women's World Cup. It's Italy versus Argentina. Well, thanks, Derek. This is such an important game. Both sides will be desperate to start this group well. Let's hope we see some great football today. And the Italy starting 11. Well, it's a 4-3-3 with two out-and-out -out wingers, but they do vary their movement. They give width, but they also make diagonal runs in field when the ball's on the opposite flank. Their performances will be key today. The Argentina first team. Well, they're playing in a 4-5-1 formation, which is set up to counter-attack at pace. Yes, they'll play with a flat midfield out of possession, but when they win the ball back, they'll break forward really quickly. Let's hope they play it well today. And they kick off here. Mariana La Roquette. Oh, good play, this. That is a very fine challenge in difficult circumstances. Girelli. Now with Chernoya. Well, she keeps moving. Well, a classic example of how to intercept. Bon Segundo. Well, not giving the opposition a look in. That strong play. Just cutting off the supply. Cristiana Girelli. And beating her opponent. But stout defending when it mattered. Mariana La Roquette. Moving it forward, but quick thinking defensively. A really sumptuous ball. Estefania Banini. Great opportunity. And there it is, the opening goal, the ideal way to start. Well, just look at this again. The speed of counter-attack is so impressive that you have to question the keeper here. It's a good finish, but she shouldn't be beaten inside the near post. She'll be disappointed with that. Goal. Well, the ball is moving once more. How important will that opening goal prove to be? Girelli. Now with Caruso. Oh, great attacking play. Textbook defending inside the box. Nunez. 
effective looking pass chance to cross fantastic work to thwart the danger and providing width a concession of a corner here Can someone get on the end of this? And cleared off the line. Estefania Banini. Florencia Bonsegundo. On the offensive. And possession lost, intercepted. Cristiana Girelli. Teammates available. Beautifully disguised ball. Oh, marvellous goalkeeping. Well, it's a top-class save from a top-class goalkeeper. That's absolutely brilliant. Corner kick awarded. And let's see if this will help them add to their lead. Delivering it. Well, not cleared away completely. What a block! Not to be advised giving the ball away in that position. Surely! And good work to deny the chance. Trying to pick out a teammate and clearing it away. Chemnoya. Can they do something positive on the counter attack? Caruso. Oh, great play. And she's being egged on by the crowd. Getting forward. And it's in! All square again. What a match this is turning out to be. Well, here's the replay. And just look at that power. That's almost unstoppable. That's a great strike. So back underway following the equaliser. And the referee allowing advantage to accrue to them. Now, who can she pick out? And outfoxing her opponent. And that is how to block. Ariana Caruso. Well, the counter chance looks very real. It has to be. Well, fantastic reflex action from the goalkeeper. Throw into Italy. That's useful play. Can they nudge in front? Well, that is quite simply a tremendous stop. Well, you have to praise the goalkeeper there. That is absolutely brilliant. The way she makes the save, you couldn't get any better than that. It's a short one. 
It's one corner after another. Who's going to get on the end of it? Well, they couldn't take advantage of the chance. Could cross it in here. A glorious chance. And that's a very good parry. And no nonsense defensive clearance. Must take the lead here. Oh, crucial tackle. Brilliant. Yamila Rodriguez. Bon Segundo. Romina Nunez. Might be onto something with that ball. And an effective clearance. A chance then for the respective managers to address their charges. It is half time here. So back underway here into the second half. Yamila Rodriguez. Well, they've lost possession of the ball. Romina Nunez. Mariana La Roquete. Estefania Banini. She has options to take the lead. Perfectly positioned to take it away. And the counter-attack is on. Options available. Well, it looked highly promising, but it came to nothing in the end. On she goes in possession. Can she pick the right option? Can they convert? And a goal to re-establish their advantage. Just look at the celebrations. Well, here's the replay, and just look at that power. That's almost unstoppable. That's a great strike. Goal. And the ball is moving again. Anyone's guess how this is going to finish? 2-1 currently. Chernoya. And a creative look about this. Well, it came to nothing in the end. La Roquete. Lorencia Bonsegundo. A really top notch piece of defending. Can they hit on the break? Oh, good-looking run. Superbly. Oh, it's a penalty in the opinion of the referee. And maybe they'll be able to level this up. And it has been judged to have been a bookable offence. Well, I think the referee's got that right all round. It was a penalty and it was a yellow card. Substitution time it is here. to make it 2-2 in it goes a well taken penalty
Well, here we see it again. The keeper tries to read the penalty, but in the end, she just makes no effort whatsoever. Well, back underway here, and they've split the four goals between them so far. Florencia Bonsegundo. It's a good-looking ball in behind. And there it is! She's only gone and made it a hat-trick. Well, as you can see, the weight of the through ball is key to this goal. And just look at that finish. 1v1 against the keeper, and she hits it with power. It's a great goal. Well, the action underway once more, and no shortage of entertainment. 3 2. And a chance to level it. Oh, crucial tackle. Brilliant. Could be dangerous. Caruso useful looking ball well no way through Mariana La Roquette can they get in behind them intercepting it intelligently just 20 minutes remaining now They might be onto something. Can they cover up? Danger averted for now. Girelli. Can they do something positive on the counter attack? Magnificent defending. La Roquette. Chernoya. Well, a really single minded piece of defending to make sure nothing untoward happened. Now, options are plenty. Excellent ball over the top. Well, last gasp defending, but wonderful chance. And a goal to increase their advantage. It's a two goal lead now. Yeah, here's the setup play. Well, it's a great little back heel, isn't it? And the movement is good, making for a comfortable finish. It's a really great goal. So the current scoreline, 4-2. Bonansea. She's made a really important challenge. Mariana La Roquette. Could be a chance to break here. Excellent assessment of the situation at the back. Cristiana Girelli. Opportunity here. And the challenge crisp and clean. Mariana La Roquette. Sachs. La Roquette. An inability to keep hold of the ball there.
Girelli. Oh, and a perfect ball now. How about this? And that is defending of the highest order. Well, they are committed to making the substitution here. Corner coming up. And over it comes. And she's cleared it away. High-class defending right on the goal line. And a super header. It looked as though it might be going in. Decent position. Could reduce the deficit. And in it goes. And you never know in this game. They might yet be able to level it. Well, let's look at this again. To pick out this pass shows wonderful vision. It's inch perfect, but I think the keeper has made a mistake here. While it's a decent finish, it should go in at that near post. It's a defeat for Italy, not the outcome their fans were hoping for. Stuart, your thoughts? Well, Derek, it was a poor result, but it was a really tight contest. Both sides had their chances, could have gone either way, but in the end, they will be disappointed.